the campground and we're gonna drive to the visitor center well near the visitor center there is a parking lot and that's where we're going to park and then we're gonna take the shuttle to the narrows which is a stop number nine now we are at the bus to go to the narrows we are just leaving the bus and we're gonna start hiking top of the door and you can get water here that's nice restaurants and then you're gonna find that like trash cans and there's a sign that's the start of the trail let's go check it out this hike is very popular so you're gonna see a lot of people here and as you see that hike he has like those water shoes with a like the tracking pole like wood pole that one you can rent, rent it outside Zion for like $27 and there is a warning size that it says flash flutes can occur anytime watch the weather and this is a map of the trail uh, this this is where we are and you just kind of follow the river that's it today flash floating is not expected so that's good down here so this is the part that you can change your shoes like if you have an extra water shoes or using the trucking poles here it helps a lot trucking pole ready these shoes they drive really quick so let's do it right now it was cold when i just get in but now i'm kind of feeling used to it the canyon gives a nice protection from the sun no wonder why this hike is so famous it's really beautiful here you have a nice view of the canyon you hike through water which is give a nice experience now we just got to a part of the trail where you can see there are there is more water there's like a small waterfall and look at this guys the water is getting deeper so I have to remove my funny pack just like the beach It's very nice over there. It is really deep right here in this side. Looks like that part is one of the tougher spots in the hike because it's pretty deep like if you go over there so you have to stick by the rock mm -hmm. right. that, uh, that was good okay. it's the way to go and we made it good job Jose wow that is beautiful after crossing this, look at this beauty. We made it. Waterfalls looks really nice. It's a lot of sand around. It's amazing. It was worth it, right, Jose? Jose is there taking a video too. And wow. Definitely we're going to hang out a little bit here.
Jose and I decide to push it a little bit farther because in the map it shows there is a campground so we want to check it out so that is the number 12 let's go check it out the campground now in this part guys there is a trail that is taking us up we should make sense that the campground is on the top so we just arrived guys and yeah this is a very nice place to come jose definitely that's something in our list for next time we just have to make sure that there is no rain like on those days that you're gonna backpacking so this is perfect and we can even explore more jose like if we come here yeah. we can just try to go more and then see how it goes yeah so now guys this is the end of for us for the trail now we are going back to the car and shower and get some food we finished the hike earlier the what i thought we talked and now we are in the bus it's around 6 30 pm it was a really nice hike going back home now right now it's 1 a.m and we, we've been driving for a few hours we are three hours from Orange County California but we decided to stop in a campground so it looks like nobody's here it's a campground by Barstone and we're gonna sleep here then very early in the morning which is gonna take off and the uh, campground is next to a railroad so tomorrow morning I will show you so all that noise is coming from the train just woke up guys and I will show you a view of this campground it's really nice around there's like a bridge over there and it was very quiet yesterday I slept like a baby this is where we slept last night pretty nice place it has a table with a roof and a big fire pit and that one that looks like a bridge those are the railroads so Jose, he say around 2, 3 a.m. he hear the, the train coming. I didn't hear it at all. But I, we did hear it when we arrived here. I think it was like one Afton Canyon campground. We are leaving now. We are going to get some hot coffee. hundred thousand miles this is why I like the engines on the Honda elements I just drove this car to Utah Arizona Nevada for a few days now coming back to California and it's driving like a champ route 66 See you, Jose. Hey, buddy. See you next trip, buddy. Stay safe. I just found Nat in the gas station. You miss me, baby. <laughs> Ready?